we're getting ready to load up the donkey for his trip to the vet tomorrow. It pretty good. It don't look. It don't look. Um, didn't look like it getting worse or nothing. Mm -hmm. You know. So we purchased Harvey. Harley. Harley. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we decided to keep the name that they gave him because that's what he answers to, right? Yeah. And so we decided to keep that name and Harley. We ended up getting Harley um, almost next to nothing. I'll just put it to you that way. Uh, when we were going to buy uh, the trailer here, we were actually buying this trailer for our goats uh, so that we can carry them um, back and forth uh, to our property um, that we're working on and um, possibly looking at the possibility of goatscaping uh, for those who may be interested in having their land cleared. Um, on, by goats naturally and so like I said they, they gave us a Harley for next to nothing now let me tell you what's really going on here he had a leg injury uh, he's only 10 months old and his mom is pregnant and his dad attacked him so his leg is hurt uh, we're going to be taking him to the vet so that they can fix up that leg. Oh, this hair is supposed to shed up his head. Yeah. So he's young, he got his still, his still early coat on. Yeah. So it's supposed to shed. Is that good, man? So Harley is a very friendly baby. Um, he's ours. And I, I just hope that he's going to be all right. Um, he was separated from everyone, um, all of the other animals that were at that farm. Uh, he was separated, um, probably because of his injury to make sure he doesn't get re-injured. So we're going to have them uh, take a look at him. Look at him. He is such a good boy. Harley, you are such a good boy. He sure is. A good boy. I see his eye. Hi, baby. <laughs> Hi there, Harley. Let me just put this over here and get a close up of that. Look at that baby. Mm -hmm. He's a good boy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You enjoying yourself, Harley. What's amazing is when we first brought him here, uh, he just started grazing right away. Uh, the enclosure that he was in, uh, where before he where he came from. Can you grab the spray too? Oh sure, the bug spray. No, the spray for him. Oh, the spray for him. Get okay. Some more on. All right. The enclosure he was in. Where'd you put it? On my golf cart, I think. Oh, I dropped it on the ground. Okay, I see it here. So the enclosure he was in, it was just eaten down to dirt, pretty much. Just pretty much eaten down to dirt. So. Uh, there was nothing for him to graze on. Uh, the previous owner um, actually said that. He's smart. <laughs> he sees what you're up to, huh? You want me to try to spray while while you yeah. feed him? Okay. So, yeah. Think that's good. Mm -hmm. Can you get the inside on? The inside. Yeah, the oh. inside spot outside. Yeah. If I pull them over here like this, you can see it. See it under there on the other side. Mm hmm. Yeah. It's hard to get to that. What do you guys want? What are you guys, guys up to? You ladies. <laughs> Cut it out. Get it. What are you all up to? Oh, good. We're here taking, well, what's funny is when uh, Harley first got released into the area here, these goats took off. I mean, they took off. <laughs> they were like, what is going on here? Now, Harley was around a bunch of um, other goats, too. They weren't in his enclosure, but uh, they were on the farm. So, 
he's very familiar with other animals. Mm -hmm. Y'all want to get close and take it from him, huh? <laughs> <laughs> What's funny is at first they, they were keeping their distance from Harley. I guess they say, ah, he's e easy going. <laughs> <laughs> I like to get this big bucket and just pour it all in the bucket. Yeah. If I put it in the top, they going I gotta get the top back. You know that um, that black feeder. Let's see if eat out my hand. You know the black feeder that we have over there, the long one. The livestock feeder. Oh yeah. We, we should bring that over here. Yeah, we'll do that. Bring it over here. Woo. They're bending over trying to feed them. <laughs> so yeah, Thank buddy, we're gonna take you to the vet, and you're gonna be all right. <clears throat> As you all can see, we love our animals. Uh, they are um, a part of the family. They are part of the farm. Uh, they are part of our lives. And so uh, we care about them, even though Harley is new to the family. Um, uh, he's our baby already. He's already our baby. We love you, Harley. Yeah, Harley. I hope everything's yeah. all right with you when we take you to the vet. <laughs> I hope you're gotta okay, go, man. buddy. We'll you see gotta you go, later. Fella. Don't give us a hard time when we have to load you up, okay? It's see for you your are. own good, buddy. <laughs> when you we are. load you up into that trailer over there, yeah. don't give us a hard time. See how easy he came over to us and everything? So yeah. we should be okay. We just can't spook him. That's why I didn't want to spray him with the water. Yeah. Because I didn't want to... Oh, right. What y'all trying to do to me? <laughs> you trying to drown me? You know, I just want to no, sure. we just want to wash off your wound. <laughs> so anyway, that's where we're going to be loading him up. Uh, first thing tomorrow morning, we'll be heading him off to the veterinarian. Yes, absolutely. I'm going the other way. There's too many bumps on the other side over there. So this is the morning that we are taking our donkey uh, to the vet. So I'm heading over here with everyone else so we can get him loaded up. Hey Harley. Oh, he's still a baby. Mm -hmm. Ten months old. Ten months. How big they get? How big do they get? Well, his parents were. About what size? 
Okay, Harley. Come on, buddy. Time to go to the vet, baby. Harley? Harley, come on, baby. Harley? Let me take you to the vet. Harley. Okay, so we're trying to get the trailer back over here to make it easier to load Harley in. We didn't have too much of a rough time when we uh, picked him up from the previous owner. So hopefully that will be our experience here as well. Come on. Opening too close to this. Here, go that way a little. Just a little. Okay, that should be good. Here, move, let's move those uh, sticks out of the way. <clears throat> no one gets behind them. We're going to grab them from the side. Okay, so we have that. Do we have a chain on it or something? Not a chain. No. You, do you have his two, uh, the two leashes, baby? Hey boy, they're going to fix you right up, okay? You're going to get a shot so you don't have tetanus. Hey buddy. Let them stay there eating for a moment. I'm glad we're taking him to the back because that um, room has pus coming out of it now. So he needs to get a tetanus shot and they need to clean that up real good. Okay, we're going to just block this in so he doesn't feel that he's going to just cut the roof. Okay, um, Jim, step inside and try to guide him with the uh, food. I can show you pull him. Benjamin, you come inside. And you guide him with the food. Jim, you pull him with the rope. And I help walk him in. There ain't nowhere to go, buddy. Nowhere to go but in. Come on. Come on, buddy. You can do it. You can. Yeah, that's a good boy. 
clip for him. Look his back legs. Okay. Okay. They, they like hooks. Just be careful. Don't get directly behind him. On the side. Is this what? Okay. Good. Good. He's in. <laughs> That's okay, Harley. Okay, let's get him in that back and close that door. Not that. Oh no. <laughs> Jacob, come lock this here. Oh, y'all gonna go out the side door? Mm -hmm. Okay. I got light from outside? Yeah. <laughs> you, you, you can't start on mommy like that, okay? What you sneaking up on me for? Huh? What are you sneaking up on mommy for? Yeah. You sneaking up on mommy. I love you, girl. I love my precious girl. I love my precious girl. Yes, I do. <laughs> you don't want that new goat messing around, huh? You like get away from my mommy. Well, you know she's my she's my baby too. Okay. Say, but mommy, I've been here longer. I know, sweetheart. We won't need that stain in the neutering. Well, I'm sorry, the neutering. Okay, so we won't need to be there as long, is that correct, uh, since uh, we won't be having that procedure done? Okay. So I'm on the phone with the vet right now. And uh, we're bringing the donkey up here uh, so we can get ready to go. And we have a delivery. So uh, we got up here just in time to receive the delivery. So we'll get that as well.
One of you get the gate for low.
you think is from the, um, getting them on here? So we got Harvey, Harley. We got Harley at uh, the vet, and they will be seeing him shortly. Um, looks like two other people pulled up with their horses. The other vehicle is already gone. Pardon me? So you have a wild donkey in there? Uh, no, he's not wild. Okay. <laughs> we just bought him a few days ago. His um, dad injured his, injured his leg, and so we wanted to get it looked at. He's only 10 months old. He's a pretty good boy, but um, he's hurt. Is that? He's hurt. Okay. Mm -hmm. I think the previous owner said he sat like that for a week, so we figured we better get him checked out, <laughs> you know. What do you do? Uh, hurt his leg real bad then? Mm -hmm. Cut open? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, his, um, I think the previous owner said his dad bit him. Oh, okay. He, yeah, he bit him, so. Yeah, two male donkeys? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that don't work. So yeah. the thing is, um, the mom is pregnant again, and so I guess he was around her too much, and so the dad decided, um, you need to get away. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's too big for him? And it's a small horse thing. So. Oh, okay. So, we may not have any problems getting him out. He's been pretty easy going. Yeah. Hmm. If I have any pony helpers in my trailer, let me look. Oh, okay. Wonderful. Thanks. Okay. <laughs> I've got a mirror in here. I'm going to swap her halter around with this one. I'll get my rope off here. It might be better. I don't know. Okay. Hey there, baby. What's going on, precious? Look like a baby cow. Calf. Oh, what's going on, sweetheart? What's going on there, honey? Oh, look at the baby calf. Harley? Yes. Harley? Yes. Okay. How are you all doing? We're wonderful and yourself. Doing good. He's just gonna help us get him um so he has some leg injuries. He got into a situation with his um his dad. His dad? Yeah. How old is he? Um I think they said he's ten months old. Okay. So the, oh, so the a little laceration on the back leg and then that the front legs. You want us to bring him out over here? Yeah, you can go ahead and bring him outside. Okay, you gonna come bring him out this way. Give me that uh, thing there. Come on, boy. Come on. Okay, boy. Precious, come See, it's on. Okay. Come on. Anyway, I, 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 
Come on, baby. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Here, tap his tap his rear. Tap his rear. Okay, there you go, fella. Good boy. Okay. See, that wasn't so bad, was it, man? I didn't want to go home. <laughs> that wasn't so bad. Oh, you guys also have a couple of cats here, right? Yeah. Yeah, they took them on the inside. Okay. Okay. You said they went and took them inside? Yes, yeah. okay. my daughters. All right, I'll be right back. Wonderful. <sighs> what do you call this thing? This is what I need to get. <laughs> it's a rope halter. A rope halter? Okay. 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 They had those. They did. Yeah, okay. so I'll grab one. Oh, that's okay. a full adult horse size one. They, well, I can find a smaller, smaller one, but okay. Yeah. They look pretty good. Okay. Excuse me. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Oh, really, I had to just put a rope around this air chest area. <laughs> but it was a lot easier because, um, yeah, I guess because we had them kind of boxed in and he had nowhere to go but in the trailer. So that's the only place you got tore up? It looks on like both a sides and then... Um, yeah. It's on that one too? Yeah, it's on, it's on both sides of that one leg. Then it looks like a little cut on his back leg. Yeah. I'm just glad he made it here. We've had him, what, three days? Uh -huh. Three days. But um, the the uh, other guy said he's been injured like this for more than a week. Yeah. 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 And there's an antibiotic spray on there. What do you mean? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I sprayed him with some, uh, what's that stuff called? Iodine solution. Some iodine oh, that, solution. that helped. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that helped. Keep the off. You'll be okay, sweetheart. Looking you around. will be okay. Try to see if there's any in here your kind, huh? <laughs> Horses. Y'all got to be related to horses y'all look alike. <laughs> <laughs> I really didn't know donkeys was this big. I thought they were always little until we were driving around them and, you know, in the movies they show them to <laughs> The first time I saw one this big, the papas, I was like, that's a donkey? <laughs> but it makes sense. You, you know, yeah. Yeah. How are you guys doing today? Oh, we're doing good in yourself. Uh, I'm doing good. So who do we have here? We have Harley. Harley, Harley. Say, so did your daddy step on you? I huh? think the guy said he bit him. Oh, he bit you. Well, that was just rude, wasn't it? Yes, it, it was. Extremely. That? You must have been misbehaving or something. He was punishing you. Well, mom is pregnant. Oh, his, he's his mom is pregnant. He's trying to keep Harley get away. Yep, it's time. <laughs> I mean, you gotta grow up sometime, don't you, pretty boy? I know. So uh, I know it says that you guys have just gotten Harley. Yes. I'm Right. How long have you had Harley? Well, about three days. About three days. Yes. How's he been doing in those three days? He's been doing fine. Um, where he was, the the ground was completely dirt. <laughs> so when he saw that green grass, uh -oh. he just took right to it. Might want to watch that though. If he overeats, that can cause some issues as well. Okay. Thank you for letting us know that. Yep. Why well, you start from eating grass and <laughs> grow? Sometimes you have to put muzzles on them. They do have oh, grazing wow. muzzles. So, okay. Oh, they have those too. <laughs> yep, they can kind of founder. I don't know if you know what that means or not. Uh -huh. um, sometimes if they eat too much and get too much sugar in their system, uh -huh. it actually affects their hoofs and causes problems there and they get lame. Okay. 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 Much. Um, and so it doesn't happen in every horse or every donkey. Okay. Um, but, you know, that's why it's good that we don't want them to get overweight. Why okay. do you get away from me? Is it because I'm telling you? So, we just learned well. something new about you, Harley. <laughs> Which, I mean, right now he is, you know, a little on the on the skinnier side, so it's okay for him to eat. Okay. But I'm saying you just got to watch it. Watch does it. that make sense? Yes. Yes, it does. Yep, yep. Well, we weren't going for a donkey. We were going for the trailer so we could transport our goats. 
<laughs> How did that happen? <laughs> yeah. Well, the guy says he's about to move. He's getting rid of this this guy and the, the mom and the dad. And so we well, considered donkeys before though because of coyotes and yeah, yeah. yeah. and we're getting all kinds of um, strange critters in the land uh -huh. in, the, in the land and just. So he, we weren't looking, we weren't trying to get him at the time we got him. He was just there. And we said he's injured, so let's get him to the hospital for 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 donkeys. <laughs> for donkeys, I love that. I love that. Uh, thankfully, it doesn't feel to be. I know it hurts. I know, baby. It's okay, precious. Does everyone? You got a good infection going on and some swelling. Yeah, it almost does look more like a bite. I think you did you. Yeah. Is that does is is that some type There's of bandage on it? Um, so this is not bandage. This is his hair. No, I meant that there. So that's his skin. That's his skin. Yeah. Oh so we're gonna goodness. clip all this up and clean it. Looks like he already tried to put some, you know, iodine on there. Okay. We well, put iodine on. He put oh, something. Put he put some purple stuff on. Okay. All right. So that's just another healing lotion. Um, okay. I want to watch him walk. Hole, so just so, walk him down and walk him back. There's a laceration on the back leg too. Oh, there is on the back leg. Okay. Yes, and then I'm not sure about the other leg, so if you can check all of them. Yeah. Doesn't seem to be affecting his walk that badly. All right, let's um, turn him around and kind of see if you can just run and jog just a little bit. let it breathe but we got to watch for proud flesh as well okay, okay. Um, which is just of course is it's like an overgrowth of tissue okay right? um, but it can get really out of control in in my equine species okay, okay. okay. Um, checking out the other horses <laughs> <laughs> but uh, you know this is going to require a lot of care on y'all's part okay. so I'm going to give him antibiotic is he still eating well for you uh, Okay. And then he's got one on the other side as well. 
The, the, that one right there. Yep. You can see it right here down. Oh, yeah. Right there. Oh, I see this a bit further down. Right, 
over to each other. Definitely look, at, um, look out for it. I want you to get the bed and some bed. I'm supposed to shed on it here, right? <laughs> mm-hmm. We're just going to use ours as possible. need a holly shower. Mm-hmm. I have he was getting upset like he was getting upset. Like, y'all leave him alone. Right. You were concerned about Harley. Were you concerned about Harley, sweetheart? Yeah, I know. He's a little fella. Hey, He's a big fella. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So because of that, you're going to have to do a little bit more aggressive treatment. And I really want him to be checked in a week. I don't think I won't be here in a week, but you can check with somebody else. Okay. Because this is more serious. Okay. Okay. Are you turning your butt towards me? I see how it is. Um, <laughs> I like I said, we got him three days ago. And the previous owner, he was kind of ailing himself. This is why he's getting rid of all of his animals. Okay, yeah. I understand. Well, I'm glad that you guys take them or taking care of them. So this is a new bottle. I'm just going to open up y'all's okay. and then I'm going to show you how to do it. And we're just gonna use it. Okay. Okay. And we're going to make an appointment to recheck him in a week with daily bandage changes with this on it. Okay. Okay. And it's not actually, it's actually not really a, well, you can clean it with a little bit of water before you apply this. Okay. 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 But don't put too much because... Uh, and dogs and cats, yes, that's what we would do. But horses, like I said, you can look up proud flesh. Mm-hmm. Okay, look up proud flesh just so you can educate yourself a little bit about that. And you'll know what it looks like. Is proud flesh can get pretty bad in these guys. So proud flesh. Proud flesh. Okay. okay. I won't explain everything. I know I'm giving you guys a lot of information. That's I'm, okay. I know you're videotaping it <laughs> yeah. all. So. Okay, buddy boy. So all you're gonna do is you're gonna take this. You know, take a, we use tongue depressors, popsicle stick, whatever you got. You can use a spoon, I guess. Okay. Just don't eat after it, even if you wash it. Going up Absolutely not. And you're just going <laughs> to sh- smush this all up in there. Okay. okay. On both sides. Yep, on both sides. On any wound that you see, really. Okay. Yeah, well, this is like the main So one. even the superficial one, we want to Yep, like I said, you can put some too. on that, too. So I can actually take this and just rub it on there. Okay. This one, as long as he's in a clean environment, you don't got to wrap this Okay. Uh, but I don't want it getting dirt. Okay. 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 
You always clean it off with some water. So, so one thing he did do, he created himself a little dirt spot yeah. in the middle. So if you feel like he's, he's going to roll and get dirty, you can just wrap it. It's fine. Make okay. sure you're not wrapping it too tight. Okay, so let me see this other wound. Oh, sorry, I've already started putting Oh, that's okay. On. I just want to see where it is. Yeah. Okay. So got this right here. Y'all can obviously go to any co-op and get you some vet wrap, okay? Vet wrap, okay. Oh, poor baby. It's actually pretty deep on the other side. Is that your baby in there? Mm -hmm. Is that a, a laceration right there in the front, too? So, no, that's where the iodine was. Okay, mm -hmm. gotcha. Yep, that's where the iodine was. Yeah, so Dad didn't like it. Or I got her. They were ornery boogers. <laughs> <laughs> so his mom is pregnant, and that's why uh, the dad the didn't want. Yeah. Mm -hmm. right. So I just take galls and stick them to that, okay? Okay. Just like that. Okay. Now I'm just going to go ahead and put this right here. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Just like that. Okay. Okay. So this is going to be treated and redressed every day for a week until it's time to... Well, we're going to do it for a week. We have to do it longer than that, but we're going to recheck and we're going to see where we are in one week. Okay, okay? gotcha. But this will not be done in a week. I'm just going right. to let you know, right. okay? Mm -hmm. But we may be able to slack off of the wrapping, okay? Okay. I'm just going to kind of go Yes. So I'm not too tight. That's the goal. You cannot be not too tight. Not too tight. Okay. okay. And this stuff can be a little bit harder to tear. So if you got some scissors, you can do some bandage scissors. It might be easier. And once you start doing that, you see kind of how it's all breaking up. Yeah. You just got to do a pair of scissors. You can make an easier clean cut. Over there, and it should press on itself, and it should be fine. Okay. But if you wanted to get you some like bandaging tape or anything like that, you can put that over there as well. Okay. Okay. Where it attaches. So and, and that one technically it doesn't need to be wrapped, but if he gets it dirty, you're gonna have to start wrapping it. Okay. 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 But the key is don't put a wrap on there and just leave it for several days because that makes it ten times worse. <laughs> okay. 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 Alrighty. So this has to be changed daily, and I guess that'll be y'all's job. Are you guys twins? <laughs> oh, they look just like okay. They're a year and a half. Whoa, how far apart? Are a they? year and a half. A year and a half. Okay, I would not have guessed that. They're they look. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> so I mean, make sure it has to be unwrapped and reapplied, just like what I did. Okay. Okay. Now, if y'all notice that y'all are looking at it, y'all been looking at it every day and clean off and be like, oh, there's more black here. It looks worse than we need to see sooner. Okay. I am going to go ahead and I'm going to give him some injections today and send you home with some oral stuff. So I'm going to give him Vanamine injection. I'm also going to go ahead and give him an antibiotic injection. Okay. okay. All right. Will one of those be the tetanus? Or? Oh, yeah. And well, I'll give you the tetanus. That'll okay. be something different. He's going to get a couple different pups. Okay. Okay. Uh, and I'm going to give him the antitoxin tetanus and the toxoid tetanus. So he's going to get two different ones. Okay. And there is a little bit of a difference about that one that I can explain later. Okay. Okay. All wonderful. All right. Well. Get good footage of this. Yes. I'm glad we bought him because he wasn't going to take him to the vet. Yeah, you yeah. know what I mean? So I wanted to get him and bring him to the vet. So we can see those eyes. I'm glad they flushed out that sore. Did y'all see when they flushed it out? How something came out of one of the other holes? Mm. Hopefully I got that.
Look at this pretty baby. <laughs> Excuse me. No problem. I'm just going to mention that to her, what you just told me. <laughs> so what I'm going to do, if you guys are okay with this, okay, uh, I can give a long-lasting antibiotic injection that's pretty strong stuff. Okay. And you guys don't have to um, sprinkle the antibiotic over the food as long as you make sure you come back within a week. Okay. Okay. Pretty sure y'all probably will. Uh, this is a little expensive, mm -hmm. okay, but I think in this case it's going to be worth it if you guys are okay with that. Okay. 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 Um, he says, uh, he, he let us borrow this here, and so he says uh, we can leave it with you. Okay. <laughs> so we're going to leave that with you. <laughs> okay, good. Yeah, I've seen you around. Okay, okay. Good. thank you. Good. Thank you. Thank you. We appreciate that. Yeah. <laughs> good. Okay, here's the other one. Now, when you say expensive, what are we talking? Oh, let me go plug it in for you, really. Quick. Okay. It's not, it should not be so. In most of, in like a full size horse, that shot's going to cost you about a hundred dollars, but it's it's like probably half of the dose. Okay. So it should oh, be around right. fifty. Yeah. Okay. okay. That just, does not include all the other stuff I'm right, going to get. Right. We but understand. It'll eliminate me sending helmet oral antibiotic. Now realize we may eventually have to be put on that one and a couple of things, but this one's going to be stronger because I want to hit it as hard as I possibly can. Okay. Well, I appreciate that, yes. and it's well worth it. We want him to feel good. Yes. All right. Him to be happy. Shot. So if you want to, you can go on the other side. Okay, we kind of want to keep this underneath him. So we could have went around the front like that. Okay. And that should kind of hold right there. Yep. Yeah? Okay. All right. We'll see how you respond to needles. You're already so dry. You've got to relax. You are really dry. <laughs> Be okay, man. It's gonna be okay. Small poke. Oh, oh, sweetheart. Oh. Okay, let's hold him. Oh, oh. Oh, yeah. Little hug. We're sorry, baby. Oh. Okay, let's get the other one. I know, we got a couple more. I know. Okay, okay, sweetheart. Okay. Sometimes that one can burn the thing a little bit. Oh, sweetheart. That's breaking my heart. Okay, baby. Oh. Okay, baby. It's okay, sweetheart. For the tetanus. Alright, now this one. Preferably, I don't want you to move. He actually does not have the best muscle, but hopefully when we get him, because he's not in the best nutrition score, if I would like him to be. Ready? This is a bigger needle, okay? One, two, three. And this is going right into the rest of the time we don't want to this one, but... Good. And now i got to rub it. Okay. So this one, it's a really thick, strong antibiotic. 
got most of it in the muscle, but they could create a knot here. That's when we're also going to recheck in a week, okay? Okay. Just trying to break it up and get it spread out. You just don't have the best. Okay. All right, baby boy. Okay. Keep on to this. So that was two tetanus shots and uh, one really strong antibiotic. antibiotic. And then the shot that I gave in the vein was called Banamine. Okay. okay. And that's a pain anti inflammatory. Okay. So it's going to bring down the swelling. It's also going to help with some pain. Okay. okay. The two tetanus shots one is the Toxoid. Mm -hmm. um, which is a vaccine. Mm -hmm. It takes two weeks to start working. Okay. The other one, the antitoxin, immediately starts working but only lasts for two weeks. Okay. That's why as soon as they get an injury, you want both of them. I know he's stressed out now. He did not like that shot. Yeah. I don't blame you. I don't like it when people poke my vein either. I about pass yes. out. Yes. Okay. <laughs> yeah. I can't right. stand that either. I am either. done with him. If you want to put him back on the trailer yes. and let him be. Okay. So, okay. all right, and then we will, we will, uh, I'll put all the charges in here, but I know y'all got cats, right? Yeah, we got the two cats. Okay, we'll go get those. Okay, great, thank you. Okay, Harley. It's okay, sweetheart. Okay, precious. I'll hold them here at the gate. Let's not forget we have to give that strap. Okay. So that they can give it back to the other fella. Okay. He's still here, huh? Oh. <laughs> yeah, he's still here. Good. So we can give it to him. Okay, Harley. Okay, sweetheart. I'm up in here. Get away from me. <laughs> We're going to take you home so you can be back with the goats again, okay? Come on, precious. Uh, don't hurt yourself again. Woo, come on, come on, Harley. Maybe we need, maybe we need a ramp. Yeah, I told him I was going to do that. Okay, this is the, the wildest. Okay. Hold on one second. You're all right. <laughs> okay, take that off. <sighs> you were still here, so we yeah, can give it to you. Thank you. No you too. Yeah, What is that called again? Uh, it's a rope halter. So basically it's just a rope and it's, you know, all a continuous rope. Okay. They call them rope halters. Rope you halter. can buy... Rural King might have a smaller one. Okay. Most of them are going to be horse size. But, okay. But yeah. I think he said he saw some at Tractor Supply, so we'll Tractor swing by there. Tractor Supply might have it too, yeah. yeah Wonderful. All, all well, thank time. you very much. Enjoy the rest of your day. Okay. So we are back home with Harley and the cats, and uh, it's raining. <laughs> it's pretty dry all day today. Um, he had his vet visit. So now we're about to unload him back into his area. He was a little irritated by uh, some of the shots that he was given. But it is time for him to return back. Ah, oh, I don't have any rain gear on, so I'm going to be wet when this is all over. Um, anyway, Harley, you are back, fella. I'm about to get in and push it. <laughs> yeah, he's, um, everybody's getting wet, huh? Yeah. That's okay, fella. You're back home now. That's a good boy, Harley. That's a good boy. Go on in. Go on in. 
If you need to get out of the rain, fella, go right ahead. <laughs> Where's the chain? <laughs> right there, it's on the other side. Whew. Here, grab this uh, the harness right here, Benjamin. Okay, we got to get in out of this rain. We are getting with. soaked. <laughs> okay. Good boy. So we see the dressing on Harley's leg and we're going to check on you later on, fella. Um, I may just leave this here. Okay. Yeah, let's take this off and leave it here, y'all. Good idea. Right here. Right there. You can get them on and get them off. Okay, Harley. We'll see you later, fella. We got to step in out of the rain. You have that protective coat on you. But we got to get out of the rain. Okay. <laughs> Seemed like such a long day. So I'm getting getting all wet in this rain, but um, now I'm about to head head on in. Uh, they're gonna ride down in the truck. I gotta get back over here, and I gotta get changed because it is pouring down but before i do i'm gonna head back here because while we were gone uh, some of the crew um, was covering um, our brassica crops because the um white butterflies are out anyone who's into gardening knows what white butterflies mean uh, they like to eat your crops so some of our things have been covered as you can see but they still have access to the rain. So they're still getting water, but they have been covered. Yes, indeed, they have been covered. So let me get on out of here. Everybody else is taking shelter right now. All right. Oh my. Okay.